We have listed very important news that happened today in the Ukraine-Russia war. Russian President Vladimir Putin has cancelled a number of provisions in tax treaties with so-called unfriendly countries in the West. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken discussed the meeting on Ukraine in Saudi Arabia and long-term security arrangements with Ukrainian Foreign Minister Dmitry Kuleba. Polish Deputy Interior Minister Maciej Wazik told a press conference today that the Polish border guard has requested the deployment of an additional 1,000 troops to the country's border with Belarus following incidents on the border. At least five people were killed and 31 injured in a Russian missile attack on the town of Pokrovsk in eastern Ukraine. Search and rescue operations continue after the attack. Zelensky talks with Dutch Prime Minister on F-16 air defense strengthening and training. The Ukrainian intelligence service announced that they have captured a Russian agent who was planning to kill Ukrainian leader Volodymyr Zelensky with an airstrike during his visit to Mykolaiv at the end of the July. The Russian foreign ministry stated that the war cannot end with the peace formula plan of Ukrainian leader Volodymyr Zelensky, which was discussed in Jeddah. Russian Defense Ministry spokesperson Igor Konashenko announced that Russian military units captured advantageous positions in the direction of Kupiansk and Kharkiv region in Ukraine. What do you think about the developments in the Ukraine-Russia war? We are waiting for your opinions. Also, for more news, continue by clicking on our video on the top right. To reach all actual news fast and reliable worldwide, please don't forget to follow and like us.